Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim! I'm Kamchak Fisco. Come and join me for an epic adventure! This seems really... Hey, buddy, how's it going? Been here a while, have you? You, you wouldn't happen to know what's going on around here, would you? No? Well, enjoy your day. Thanks for the help. Okay, there's like five or six people in here just staring. And he just walked up and looted that guy. What the hell? That must be the other entrance. Servants. They're servants? Hello? You, won't leave here alive. you shouldn't have done that. So yeah, they're like brainwashed or indoctrinated or bribed or something. That is weird. Sorry, man, you joined the wrong team. I don't know why you do something crazy like that. They're Falmer, man. There was one more. Where did they go? There you are. <laughs> Sorry, man. You, you, you. I, I don't understand how you were servants. You have weapons. Why didn't you fight back? Okay, so we've got two ways back to Blackreach. Wait a second, where does... I want to check where the exits come out, because one's going to be on the other side of the tower. Which is... This one. Oh no, this one had three entrances. There was one on the left and one on the right, and then this one. Okay, so that's where the three ground floor entrances er, exits go. So that one would be the third exit, so we do want to go up. Okay. A little weird, but alrighty then. Let's go check out what's on the bridge outside, see what that last Falmer is. Is it Falmer or is it Falmir? I'm not sure which it actually is. I just say Falmer because it's faster to pronunciate quickly. And is that a servant? Is that the guy who was sneaking by the whole time? So there's an upstairs to that place too. Pumping station. That's new. What are they pumping exactly? Am I just to assume that all these are bad guys? Because... I'd really like to free them if I could, but that didn't even remotely seem like an option last time. Yep, they're all servants. That means they're all going to try to kill me at some point. Sorry, guys. I wish there was a way to free you, because that just seems like bullshit. Servant went down there. There's another upstairs, but I think we have to go out and come back in to get around to it. Okay, what's with the freaky pool? Can't even jump into it for some reason. Hmm. Hi! How you doing? Holy crap. I was not expecting you to be right around the corner. Okay, so we can't light up the brazier. Uh, where does this go? Silent City Catacombs. Alright, so if this branches, maybe we do want to go back and search the other building first. They didn't realize how much this goes down. If this goes into a whole catacombs area, that could be pretty lengthy. Yep, that's what I thought. It just leads to the other end. So there must be something that was in that gated area. Otherwise, what would be the point of this? This would just be silly. It's all that for a chest, huh? And an autosave, apparently. Okay, sure. So let's go back out onto the... Uh, walkway out here, and then we can go down to the other building. But we should be able to take out the guy from upstairs and just do a long shot with the crossbow. Alright, so how... Do I even need to aim up from this distance? No, I don't. Okay, good to know. This is it gonna hurt, but who cares? <laughs> Ow. That didn't hurt nearly as much as I thought it was going to. Alright, to the Hall of Rumination. Let's learn about what they were thinking. I'm sure they were deep, intricate, and almost incredible thoughts. I... Creative is what I meant. But yeah, I wanted to say credible. I'm just gonna hide in the shadow. You go ahead and poke your head out and find out what the hell happened. Did you hear something? Wow, could I just rapid shoot through all these guys? Possibly. I am... Kind of in the shadows. Someone there? I don't know. Somebody here? You tell me. 
Pretty sure it's nobody but you ghosts. Just saying. Just my two cents, but I'm just, uh, you know... Ow! That went right into your heart! At least it would have been fast. Um, I, I opened the... Okay, there's a switch for that. I... I really have to stop misclicking. So this leads to a bed? That's a little weird. And gears that we can't interact with. Okie dokie. That seemed worthwhile. I keep thinking she's alive. I'm gonna... I don't mean to be... That is not the... Wow. There we go. You look at least semi-dead or something, please, so I stop thinking you're alive and try to shoot you again. You know, I could probably put you in a far less um, compromising position. I... I give up. I, I give up. She's on the ground. That I just um. I I'm not saying anything. Let's make the lever. That opens the door. Okay, good to know. There's another servant in here. Oh, a sleeping servant. Got it. I feel horrible about not having an alternative to freeing these people. You know, because I I can't let them out. I can't free them from servitude. But at least I'm raising my stealth? Oh, that's horrible. No, you saw nothing! You saw nothing! You saw nothing? You should've listened. You didn't see anything. Okay. Sorry I'm not being as, um... Entertainingly loopy as usual. I'm actually kind of exhausted. Didn't get a whole lot of sleep last night, and... Just finished recording a surprisingly grinding session of Payday with uh, Boylag on his channel. So yeah! Not yeah, quite up to my usual stupid self. Well, I'm always stupid, but you know, my entertainingly stupid self. Wait, where does this go? Blackreach. Okay. So that leads to one of the other ways. Where the hell does that go? So if that was one of the ways up, Okay, wait, where does... is this the upstairs area that we saw? Yes, it is. Okay. So, was there anything over here? No. Okay, so we've essentially searched everything but the catacombs. So, let's see where the other area goes, and then we have more areas to go down below. But I'm guessing those would intersect with wherever the catacombs go. That would make the most amount of sense. How am I seeing? Whoa! Hello! A lot of you. I'll have your head. I would you just hold still for a second? Thank you for your cooperation. Whoa! Is there anything behind? Hello? Is there just a pot? Well, that was productive. Moving on. I can jump on the... Well, I probably can't jump on the ball from here. It's too far away. Oh, man. Did the body slide off below? I might be able to make that jump. Not that it would accomplish anything, but I might be able to make that autosave jump. I'll never get used to that. That is jarring as hell. Okay, another freaky stone chair that's like some kind of throne or something. So it looks like the altar is really the only other way to go. Did the body fall down below? I'd like to be able to see without falling off. I can't tell. There were, what, three or four of them. So that's what, one... Two... Somebody had to have fallen off. Alright, so it looks like there's nothing else up here. It's just the catacombs. And the other bizarre entrances that I'm hoping just intersect with the catacombs, honestly. <sighs> Otherwise, we got like three more areas to go investigate after we're done with the catacombs. At least now we're on the ground floor and we can investigate that body that obviously fell off the uh, scaffolding up above. Where was uh, that? Would be right about a here ish? Aha! There he is. Not that he probably had much of anything. He was wearing rags, but still. So we've got the three other entrances that we saw, and we've got the catacombs. So let's quick save real fast. I don't know why I did that. We're about to enter a building, and it's going to autosave when we transition. Let's go investigate the catacombs. 
Uh, they were all right. They were below me. No, they weren't. They were upstairs because it went around and then led back down. I'm an idiot. I is the dumb that can't remember anything. That's the sad part. I really am not that stupid. I, I just in the last several years, my brain has turned into Swiss cheese, and I can't remember for shit. It really sucks. My long-term memory is still really good. I remember conversations really well, but I can't remember what happened in... I remember what happened in the game, but I can't remember which direction is where, and I get, like, easily turned around, and that never used to happen in video games. And it doesn't happen except in open-world adventure games like this. I mean, it probably wouldn't happen in Fallout. But for some reason, in games like this, they get a lot of shinies and sparklies and a lot of terrain to it. For some reason, it's easy for me to get turned around, and I don't know why. More modern or futuristic environments, it doesn't seem to happen as much. So I don't know if there's something about my brain that's just not firing correctly on older, uh, or not older, but on, um, uh, oh, what is this? Fantasy. Or, uh, uh, my brain isn't working. Okay, wait, so where the hell was the entrance? It was down here. I I knew that. I see. Just just made my point. The the whole thing I was saying. It made 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 my point. Hi guys. Do you still get a stealth bonus if you kill them before the eyeball completely opens? I always wondered that. So obviously the eye opening means they know someone's in the area, but they haven't spotted you yet. Uh. That's a texture glitch. Sure. We'll pretend that isn't there. I wish I could turn the bloom effect off, that whole it's bright until I get in the dark and then suddenly it's well lit, because even though we solved the lighting problem, that bloom still causes some degree of blindness temporarily. I understand the logic behind that graphical effect. In some games it works beautifully. In this one, it's mostly just... interference. <laughs> it's kind of a pain in the butt, actually. Shoot you in the shoulder. Uh, did you have any fr Okay, you had at least one friend. Damn it, he moved. Come on, buddy. Uh, where- there you are. Did you stop, or what, what are you doing? Okay, I got him anyway. There's at least one more, because we're not in the clear yet. Are you down below? H hello? H hello? Hello! Is anybody home? I, that was probably excessive. Dude, if they had a yell key like that for making a stupid impulsive decision like that, I would actually use that from time to time. <laughs> then again, I'm the kind of person that in a stealth game will do something ridiculous just to draw somebody's attention and then go back and hide in the shadows just to club them unconscious. I would definitely be what you'd call an aggressive stealth player. <laughs> so where is this other... Ah, there's somebody. I don't know if it was you, or if there's still somebody in the main room. That's the question. So that goes down, we can obviously just drop off, that's probably not the healthiest approach. Did this person fall? Oh yeah, they fell here, but this isn't actually below. Is this? Oh yeah, no, there's nothing up there. You! Were you the one who heard everything? I think it was you, because that would make the most sense, you're still in the area. So we do want to go through there and go back around and auto-save while I interrupt my entire conversation. Go back around and it wraps down below, is what I was trying to say. At this point I'm not commentating, I'm just stating the obvious because my brain is just not working and I can't think enough to say something funny or creative. Because uh, I'm in super stupid mode today for some dumbass reason. I don't know, man. I don't get it. I'm stupider than usual right now. My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. I really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoyed them. So you all take care of yourselves, and if you want to see more of me, keep up the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below, and please remember to take that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.